Hi, Eric here. I'm going to show you how to set a follow-up without completing a connect. So here I am on the dashboard, and let's say Tony comes up, and I want to set a follow-up. I don't want to connect with him right now. What I need to do is actually go to his record by clicking on his name right here. Okay, that takes me to his record. Now what I'm going to do is set the follow-up. Now remember, in the connect, if I, if I create a follow-up, I have to log that connect. However, if I just go right here to follow up, I can just set a follow up like this. And as soon as I do that, that follow up is set. I don't have to do anything else. Okay? I could even create a custom date if I wanted to. Let's do that. Okay? So you create that follow up. I'm going to do it for tomorrow so it shows up on my dashboard. So I want to just show you guys that this is set now. I'm going to go back to my dashboard and when I go to my follow up list, there he is, right there on the top of my follow ups. Okay? I can also get to my follow ups by going to team and clicking upcoming follow-ups, I can see my entire follow-up list all at one glance. Okay, so that's how you do it. That's how you set a follow-up with somebody who, um, without completing a connect. Another way you could do it is you could look somebody up like this. Let's say you're talking to somebody and they say, hey, yeah, let's talk tomorrow, and you want to put it in your thing. You can look them up. I'll look up my wife here. You could look them up um, on your phone quickly and just set a follow-up, okay? And then you don't have to worry about it. They're on your list done. Tomorrow they'll be on your follow-up list. Okay, I hope that was helpful. Talk to you guys soon.